Good morning, guys. I hope you guys are having an awesome Friday. Today, what we're going to do, we're going to talk about another bodysuit. Uh, what I have on, guys, this is my turmeric face scrub. I have severe acne, so I've been doing this, and through the grace of God and my manifestation, my face and my dark circles was horrible. So I use turmeric, lemon, sugar, honey, vitamin E, and a touch of lavender. Lavender deal with anxiety and different stuff like that. And I put a touch of peppermint oil. Just do very little because a peppermint oil will burn your eyes. But the peppermint replenishes your skin as well. So anyway, I'm going to show you guys how to make a bodysuit. But today is going to be with a V-neck. And we're using a four-way type spandex. So this yesterday or whatever day I did it. I did the whole connective bodysuit. And... That one is okay, but I don't like sometimes how to have that Barbie-like look because the way it's not a seam down the front, so it gives you that type of look. So we're going to do one another way. So we're doing the pants. So we cut the pants, and we're going to attach it, and see this is a, a four-way. Uh, so I'm going to turn it around, and I'm going to show you guys all of the pieces, and then I'm going to show you all how to do the V-neck. So hold on. Let me turn it around. Okay, so these is the two pieces for the pants. This is the shirt with the V-neck, and these is the sleeves. I'm going to turn it around. I already attached one side of the V-neck, and I'm going to show y'all how to do the other one. So, and this has got so much spandex, I could just get my body through this V-neck hole. I would not have to do a zip or anything. So, let me turn it around and show y'all how to do it. Hold on. Okay. So, as you can see, I got the V-neck. So, what I'm going to do now, I hope y'all can see. I'm going to take the other part, okay? And you connect it right sides together. So, when I'm connecting it, go a little bit over the V. So, I'm starting to pin it. But... This is how you would do the V-neck for any of your collars that you're doing. Yes. So I'm like, let me show how to do a V-neck. And then this um, bodysuit, you just connect it at the waist. So you're making a shirt and stuff is not one piece. And you're connecting a shirt to the pants, different things like that. So, but I'm like, the V-neck is a lot more better. And then you cut your, your pieces. Oh, I didn't even show y'all how to do that. Tell y'all about that. Let's see. I think I throw it in the garbage. Y'all see I took this piece, folded in half, and made it um, going the uh, uh, against the uh, crosswise grain. So it had that spandex. And I did a zigzag stitch. So just make a long piece, long enough to go all the way around the neck. And then you even it up and you're going to cut it in two pieces. And a lot of times people iron their stuff with this spandex and stuff. I don't. But I don't want y'all to get bad habits. You'll iron this out. But it's like, I'll be like, it's spandex. Why do I got to iron it? It's not going to show. It's spandex. Then you get all the way around here. Boom. Ah! Be quiet. Be quiet. I'm working. Hush. So... So I got the V-neck like that. So I'll go take it and sew it down. You see? I got it pent like that. I would take that and sew it down. And when you sew it down, when it wind up being finished, I think I got to just go sew it down. And I'm going to come back. Okay, guys. So if you can see when you do that. So we took one bias piece, put it on this side. And then we took the other piece, put it on this side. You see I crisscross over? So that's how you would make the V-neck. So that's how you make the V-neck. So now um, we're making a bodysuit. So that's the top part. Of course, you will connect the sleeves. So these are the sleeves. So we'll connect the sleeves. Of course, the sleeves will be connected. You know, I sew the sleeves on. And then the pants, I put one leg inside the other and we'll connect the pants. And then when we're done with everything, we'll just, we'll just line the pants up with these notches here. 
side seam, side seam, and then the back. And then we'll, we'll roll the pants over right sides together and we will connect the pants. That's how we would do that. We'll connect the pants. So, but I just wanted basically to show you guys that V neck because I know a lot of times when we're making stuff, it's like, hey, how do we get that? So you're just doing that V neck criss cross and you sew down one side and have it a little bit hanging crisscross the other side sew it down the other side connect it in the back and then you will have your v-neck bodysuit so you see how deep this v-neck is the deeper the v you won't even need a zipper if it's got a whole lot of spandex so i'm not gonna need a zipper because of the the spandex that it got so I hope that helped you guys on how to make a v-neck and then there is more detailed videos than mine on YouTube too that you guys can watch so I hope that helped you guys how to do that and do them body suits so when you're making a body suit just take a pair of leggings and your shirt you stop it at your true waist so if you're going to make want to make a whole body suit stop it at your true waist and then your pants stop it at your true waist and then you will connect it that way hope that helps thanks bye bye Okay, guys, so this is what your bodysuit will look like. And then you remember I said you're going to connect it to your true waist. So you're going to connect this seam to that seam, that seam to that seam, that seam. We're going to connect the back, and then we're going to connect the sleeves. And with this V-neck and the type of spandex, see how I can just take get out of this bodysuit with no zipper. So this will be all... Uh, in one bodysuit. The only difference is the one that I made the other day. Remember I told y'all that front don't have a seam. So I have the tendency to kind of to me look like Barbie. So I don't like how that looked. So from now on I make my pants with the seam down the middle. So this is how the bodysuit is not connected yet. But I just wanted to show you guys because sometimes my videos be delayed. But this is how you will connect it. So when you get ready, when you guys get ready connected, you're just going to connect it right sides together. So when it comes time to connect this top, I'm going to connect it right sides together. So see how much spandex in it? So I'm just going to roll it down and find this front seam, match up this seam, and I'm going to connect it and sew it all the way around, and I'm going to connect the sleeves. So that's how you would do this bodysuit. Thank you, guys. And again... My Tomorac scrub, because you see the acne, and this stuff really works. So if there's somebody like me that was dealing with bad, bad acne, this Tomorac stuff really, truly works. I mean, my face was so bad, and I was just like, oh, my gosh. And I just prayed about my face. I'm like, oh, my face. And I just had to always make up, make up, make up. I still wear my makeup, but now I'm confident where my skin look healthy, where I can come out of the makeup and don't always have to get on camera with the makeup on. So I hope this helped you guys in making those bodysuits. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.